so I guess Jim decided it was time to move some stuff around. Just came out here Sunday morning. Corona swap meet was yesterday. I got these two tires. That's it for the back of the Model A. So I guess apparently we're going to take them up and try to get them put on. Man, he's got these ones off. <clears throat> also need to measure their end while we have it like this so we can look for a new one. That's like a stock 1950 Mercury rear end or something. <clears throat> anyway, the bug's all assembled. Seats are in. Everything's back together. Just waiting on the new steering wheel. Front bumper's on. Stuff like that. So yeah. Yes. Whenever it's not raining, we'll take this back over there and bring his truck over here. Who knows when that'll be? So when we were at the swap meet, we, <laughs> we stored the tires, and I'll, I'll call him an acquaintance now, an acquaintance of ours, in his booth there. And apparently he labeled them for us. And we didn't even notice. We went back to his booth, carried them half a mile. <laughs> went and picked them up, loaded them up in the truck. Brought them out here, put them in the garage. Didn't notice. <laughs> Touch him notice the, the label on them today. Uh, unbelievable. Anyway, I forgot to get a shot of these. But there they are. Crappy ass tires. <laughs> mm. You know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> but they look pretty good on there for being crappy. Got the four turned around. Probably took five gallons of gas to do so, so now it's out again. So I can buff this side. And uh, the bug is, needs the deck lid, the roof, and the hood buff, and the driver's door top, and whatever else buffing I need to do where I missed. That's pretty much done. Except for the fender repair. <coughs> and then, uh, <laughs> yeah, on to something else. That's it. With all the excitement going on here. Wonderful weather. No, oh, what are you measuring, sir? You have a rack on this thing? Is it power or manual? Um, it's pretty much power when I'm behind the wheel. <laughs> right. See, you're filling up my car wash.
for an old jalopy like this. Jim brought this over so I could buff on it while he goes on vacation. What kind of guy he is, you know, wants to make sure I have something to do. That's not quite how that went down. That's pretty much how that went down, so I got I sanding on it already here. Uh, and uh, he just wasn't happy with how this was holding up. <laughs> Told me I had to fix it. <laughs> Told me I had to strip this down to metal, rebody work it, repaint the hood. But I decided that I'd try to buff it first and repaint it next year. So that's what's going on. Don't really know what's going on. It has little bubbles tiny bubbles just like the old ford maybe you just want to be like the ford sir right. fit in. except these ones sand it out the ford it goes right through <laughs> then you have colored bubbles Side sand it to 2000, and that is where I'm stopping forever. You gotta do this, but I can't reach all the way. Oh, I shut the hood all the way. Maybe now I can reach. Let's see. Nope, still can't reach. So I gotta do this for 2000 and then 3000 everything and then 